We've all been out in public at some point in our life and seen a Karen in the middle of a total meltdown over something stupid and meaningless, making everyone's lives 500 times harder. And we've thought, I really wish a police officer was here to see this. Well, your wish is our command, as in today's video we show you the business end of Karen Cop Encounters, watching the cold silver cuffs of justice being firmly slapped on the wrist of Karen Kine. Let's jump in. After thinking she's funny on a Facebook live stream, this Karen pushes the limit with these patient officers who've had enough. Wait for it. Here's okay. license back. You need to leave the property. If you don't, you're going to jail. <laughs> I'm going to jail, y'all. If, if you don't leave the property, you're going to go to jail. So you leave this, this property. You need to leave now. Y'all. Leave now. Go to jail. Last I mean, warning. Leave the property now. You're going to go to jail. I mean, how long is it? Shouldn't have kicked me. No, I did not kick you. It's on camera, Don. No, it is on the camera, Don. Yeah. I got no Facebook Live, you oh, piece you of You tell the judge. I will tell the judge. All right. You got me on Facebook Live, you piece of Can you please pick up my Get up, up and I'll get your stuff. Get up, we'll get, you, stuff. Get up okay. and I'll get your stuff. I will. What? This big-headed, know-it-all male Karen refuses to leave when asked to by the police. Well, he must have a lifelong dream about wanting to be arrested. And something tells me today is a dream come true. Oh. Are you really gonna do you're going to make... Yes, you're going to have that to point, drag me out. At that point, you can... This is me. what you are doing. At that point, you could... You are sowing discord within our communities at every level. It's disgusting. Do you harass your clients and, and when, when they're at your restaurant to put on masks? Sir. Do you oh, harass sir. them? Sir. We're not we're not gonna argue. Do you? you? At this point at this point you could be facing additional charges of obstruction if you don't if you don't. Of what? I, I get it. I get it. So then I get, get it. it. I get it. You can you're gonna, gonna have to okay. drag me out. This is absurd. Completely absurd. You know that, right? right? He just wants to have a say in what's going on. But we pay. We pay school taxes. We just don't resist. We all believe in what you do. This is an embarrassment, and you all should be embarrassed. This is a joke. Even when high up in the sky at 30,000 feet, somehow a Karen will always worm their way into making it all about them. And this next clip is no different, as this Karen refuses to adhere to the airline's policy, thinking she's better than everyone else, so is swiftly removed at the hands of justice. Yep, you're going to have to get off the aircraft, yeah, okay? Yeah, and you're out there, yep. and I compliment you in that way. Anyways. She's a representative of the aircraft. They don't want you flying on their plane today, okay? So you're going to have to get Not off the aircraft. made us way and way and way. Yeah, that's the way it is, but right now I'm going to need you... And that's fine, and I will respect that. Okay, so I'm going to need you to grab your bag and just and step off the aircraft. And I did not do aircraft. anything, actually. Just we'll talk about just it outside. Just All right, yeah, yeah, you grab won't. Grab your bag and yeah, just step yeah, off you the won't. Okay, but I need you to get up. No. Okay. You need me to get up? You ready? So I'm going to say what I am meant to say yes, yes. no to everybody. Do you want to get arrested? I really Then honestly, stand up and get off the aircraft. That's all you I have really, to do. I really, it's not about that, man. Dude, that's not healing. We're not healing. If I get off the plane, no. you said you wouldn't arrest me. So you as a cop should have to honor that. You should have to honor that. That's my right. After being asked to leave a hotel by the staff, this Karen refuses to leave. Even the police ask her nicely. But nice and Karens don't mix. And she continues to huff and puff until the police have enough. Then you hear the universal battle cry of Karen Kine. I've done nothing wrong. Keep an eye out for sudden leg break. Take these cuffs off. This is completely unfair. I've literally done nothing wrong. Well, you're under arrest, so that's the I'm reason under you're arrest under what? For oh, trespassing. What? I'm not trespassing. I'm waiting for a room. I'm waiting for a room and I have a broken leg. I'm literally waiting for a room and I have a broken leg. That is completely unfair. You're not even walking. You're literally making you it more painful. Walk. You're literally making it more painful. Well, are you going to walk? Or I'm trying to walk and I can't. You may just have to pick her up. It hurts so pick bad. Just say it. It hurts so bad. Okay, one, just one leg. I can't move my other leg. That's not the hurt leg. Alright. Oh, let me sit down. Let me sit down. You're gonna put your leg up. We're gonna wheel you. 
After the police are called on this shoplifting Karen, she starts to act sketchy and insists she's stolen nothing and that the cashier has made her feel embarrassed. No, Karen, I think you've managed that all by yourself. Telling you want to check it, you could check it. But no, she didn't come like the last time. She didn't come from in back of the counter. She sent two to do it. No, you didn't do that. You did. You disrespected me the last time I was here. This she disrespected. She disrespected me. She don't like to be disrespected. I want my stuff. You know why you are you are and guess what? And guess what? It's cool because the next one you do a stay like that. Hold on, hold on, hold on. I'm not gonna throw her. Yo, son, I got you. I got you. Stick it up, you. Stick it up, you. Trying to be clever or sarcastic with a cop is never a good move, especially when they're telling you to move from a fire lane. Guess this Karen thought she was funny. News flash, she's not. Really bad day. Can you take your glasses off for me, please? Why is that? I don't feel safe with your glasses on, it, and I would like to see your eyes. Oh, you would? Yep. Okay. Where are you coming from? It's that's not that's not an issue. Okay. You have no right to ask me that. Where are you coming from? I'm just checking on you. Can you please take your glasses off so I feel a little safer? No, the sun's in my eyes. Okay, well then I I will be leaving now. Okay. Thank you for your help, okay. officer. I've seen you but sitting here, so. Okay. I don't feel safe with your glasses on. Okay. I I don't feel safe with your glasses no. on. Are you all right? I saw you, I passed by you here earlier. Yeah, I'm not. I'm not okay. Okay, what's going on then? I already told the other officer. What other? Oh, the other. You talked to someone else. Yeah, the guy that wasn't wearing glasses. Okay. I don't talk to cops he that stopped, wear glasses. He by earlier. He was. Okay, I'm not talking to you because you obviously don't have a clue what the hell is going on. Okay, so are you leaving now or what? Why does it matter what I'm doing, officer? Well. 
See that sign right there? What, the sign that says State Fish and Game Refuge? Uh, no, the, the other one that says No Parking Fire Lane. Is there a fire going on here? It doesn't matter. Okay. Okay. Thanks for the camera. Hi. You're welcome. Uh, so why don't you uh, leave then? Okay, I'm going to leave that? right now. Yeah, I see it. Yeah, so I'll leave right now. Thank you. That's great. Thank you so much for your help, officer. Have a good day.